The Lennox Stakes, seven furlong group, two, three-year-old plus. Here the roar up the top for Django. Then we've got Hit the Lid, Maranello, King's Ghost, Santa Anna, Anching, Acidus, Molly at Steps, Anching, Abat, Abatia, uh, Bay of Cats for Hilltop Stables, a nine-to-four favourite, and Chambray for Hands Jones. And they're off. Pretty good line. Kicking up on the fence now is Chambre. Will be our leader. Six furlongs to go. Anching Acidus out wider. Here the raw Bay of Cats, the favourite's got a nice fence run there. That'll be handy in the closing stages. Especially around that bend. Then we hit the lid here. The raw Santa Ana Anching Acidus. Anching Abatia. King's Ghost. And um, oh, there's, John's got two in this one. And uh, Molly at Steps and Marinello. The Bay of Cats was the favourite. So as they come on down to the three furlong. And there's runs of plenty here. And Chambray still leads. But um, Anching Abatia moves up onto its outside, and also there is uh, King's Ghost hit the lid. Anching Acidus as they're inside the two, and it's uh, Anching Abatia in front of Chambray. Anching Acidus out wider. Favourites struggling to get into this race here, but it's still Anching Abatia in front at the half. Now they're diving late. King's Ghost out wider and between them hit the lid. But I reckon King's Ghost wins from hit the lid. Uh, no idea for third. Because they'll cross the track. And maybe the favourite's got third Bay of Cats. It looks like what's happened. So congratulations to John with King's Ghost. A nice handy winner there. Hit the lid. Pontypool Racing was second. Bay of Cats was third for Hilltop Stables. Chambray ran well to hang on for fourth for Hans Jones. And Anching Abatia for Vinnie Gerard ran fifth.